Hi, my name is Lydia. I'm 11 years old and I have created a board game, Survival the Board Game. Um, so one of, there are many components that make this game fun. First, you get a job. You can start out as a founding a trainee for a spy, a street rat, or a trainee for the war. You can go to pilot, army, general, captain, commander. There's so many possibilities, and really, these jobs are only titles. You can say, I was a trainee, work, I worked as a spy, but then I decided to go to a farmer for the rest of my life. It's really just your backstory. No other board game gives you backstory, so um, that you get to create. So to get food, you can dig to get oysters over here. You can fish to get fish. You can go kill animals over here, or you can tame them. There are so many choices you can do. But I think, in my opinion, the easiest thing to do is shake to get free. So here, shake, shake, shake with that. The tree. So you can get fruit. You roll the die to see what you get. Say I rolled a four, I get a coconut. Um, you can kill horses for me. You can give chickens. You can kill chickens too. It's stuff like that. But you gotta cook the meat or else you'll get food poisoning. Now, if you don't say you're a, you kill a cow, you get uh, beans. The reason why you get beans is because Jack in the Beanstalk, he traded his cow for beans. So if you kill him, you get beans. You can, um, I, what's it called? Craft the beans into seeds so you can, uh, grow a crop in your land. You have a piece of land for paper and you get, if you have like a hundred of each material, you get to make a house and you sometimes have to estimate what you want to um, what you want to do because not all the time it has it in the crafting manual over here. So sometimes you just gotta guess. Say I want a fence. That's like twenty sticks. Okay, I got twenty sticks. I can make a fence to keep my animals in and my piece of land. Um. The volcano is another dangerous thing. If you say, I have all my XP, and by the way, you get XP for crafting, except for one. Do you want to show this? Oh, yeah, I'll show that. I have all my XP except for one, and then I roll a one or a six, the volcano has exploded. Then every single player has to roll to see if they can keep their XP or throw it away. This is a, um... A, she a profile. You have your person, you start out with your person, your food bar, and your wood axe. Now when you have a wood axe, that's the one thing you start out with. Now me and my brother played around and I lost my axe, but I didn't have enough to do it. So I'm going to shake the tree to get a lot of fruit and trade someone to get two more pieces of wood so I can get another axe. You can trade, you can mine over there. It's just, you need the starting manual, you need to, the game board. It's really a bit of a complex game, but I think if you practice, 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 you'll be as great as the maker, me. <laughs> That's the end of that okay. part. And then how did you keep this manual together? I sewed it together. You sewed it, That's so cool. Okay, and then? Anything else you want to add? Nope, I think that's about it. If you have any real questions how you can make your survival the board game, just ask me.